Welcome back for a little bit more Suikoden. I just think I left off the last video right at this exact point, I believe. I don't know. Editing's weird. Um, let's see. We just saved the Dragon Knights and their dragons, and we lost the beautiful black. Very sad and unfortunate. And we were exploring the castle to see if any new events would transpire after that little conversation. Not really seeing anything so far. Maybe Mathayu has something to say about it all. Or maybe we actually need to just go outside and touch some grass. Oh, never mind. You're back. Was your meeting with the Dragon Knights a success? Uh-huh. Did you manage to secure an alliance? Don't worry, medical officer. Just that Humphrey could be a little friendlier to others. What? That, that was so weird. By the way, who's this silent fellow here? Kasumi and Kryn captured him hanging around the castle. He refuses to say anything, so we were waiting for you to come back and decide what to do with him. Are you Commander Weed of the Liberation Army? Thank goodness. Now I can complete my mission for Master Warren. I kept silent because I was order under strict orders not to speak to anyone until I met you face to face. Kasim Hazil, who took over the northern defenses after two McDowell, has recently begun to apply extreme pressure on rebel factions. Looking for a comeback. My master Warren is a famous man of wealth in the north, long respected even by the Imperials. But as a man of honor and generosity, he harbored many fugitives in his mansion. As a result, his home was surrounded by Kasim and his troops. Master Warren and Sir Victor, who had just happened to have dropped by, fought hard against the Imperials, but they were eventually captured and taken prisoner. Uh-oh. This is what Master Warren told me to tell you. Commander Victor is one of our most powerful soldiers. Warren, despite his wealth, is an honorable man with a large following. We must go and rescue them. At present, Kasim's troops number more than 8,000, and they're a trained army, whereas we're just a ragtag notch. Well, we've already beaten lots of trained armies, so I don't think that's really relevant, Flick. <laughs> Commander, despite its name, the Liberation Army is not yet a unified army. To continue fighting in the future, we need to give the troops some proper military training. Okay. Let me make the necessary preparations. I suggest you retire now. You have a busy day ahead. Okay. Need to grab another person. Yippee! Alright. What do we got? We got Humphrey, Flick, Valeria. Actually, let me put Humphrey back. We'll keep Flick, I guess. He's pretty strong. And I like his ruin. We gave him the Cyclone, so we'll hold on to him. Who else would I like? Um, how do you keep Luke back in the party? He was really, really strong with his magic. In fact, we might give him the Cyclone rune. And then give him and flick the Wind rune. The Hate rune? What does that do? Seems interesting. I don't know who I want to take with me. <laughs> but he has a Thunder Rune. That's kind of cool. This hero is really cool. Maybe it was pretty strong. I guess we'll bring Cleo with us. Her fire magic's pretty pretty strong, so bring her along with us. Let's go take a nap, get all of our runes back. Or I guess spell casts back. Oh you're up here too? Oh excuse me, I'm practicing my disappearing technique. 
I'm not doing a very good job. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> um, hmm. Oh yeah, that's right. I think our room, our room, is over here to the left. Commander, I have an important matter to discuss with you. Okay. It appears that a spy has infiltrated the Liberation Army. While you were away, I sent Kasumi and Kryn on a reconnaissance mission into Imperial territory. According to their report, it appears that there is an intelligence leak somewhere in our army. So if you permit, I'd like to oversee the military military training maneuvers tomorrow. Okay. Thank you, sir. You must be tired. I will leave you now. Commander, do you hate me? Do you blame me for the loss of Tio and for leaving Pond behind? You must think I am a callous man, but I am prepared to sacrifice anything to win this fight. Even if you cannot forgive me, please remember that this is war. Bro, I don't have any hard feelings towards you at all. Aw oh, man, I gotta make the party again. Ugh. How dare you? How dare you, sir? Go. Oh well, let's remake the party. I wonder who the spy is. Person? I already forgot. Oh, it's Flick. That's right. He's actually pretty strong. He's a good fighter. And then we were going to change his rune around, which I think was on the first floor. I wonder if we need to go outside, or... Everything is ready. Okay. Just in case there's some kind of weird event, let me go swap their runes over. And change formation. Should be in the back. There you go. Everybody's happy now. So the third or the second floor? <laughs> Man, I still, I still don't know my way around this castle. Second floor. Okay. Ugh. I hate when you shave. Like, I shave my head. And for some reason, always at the back of my neck, it's always so freaking itchy. It was the first one, okay. Like, it's not razor burn or anything, it's just... The skin back there is much more sensitive than the rest of my head for some reason. And it's so freaking itchy. I hate it. Hello there, I would like you to change my runes around. Pretty please. Oh my god. Not room, hold on. Take this off. Like you have the lightning crystal. Then you just give up this medicine. We don't need it anyways. Work. Move Cyclone from you. Give you the wind crystal flick. Cyclone Crystal to look. look. Alright, now we're ready. You know what? Just for fun, maybe I will upgrade Look's um, weapon. Who knows, maybe I'll give him like, more magic bonus or something. Probably not, but... Yeah, no. Welcome.
dust rod. Yippee! Alright. Let's see. Did anything change? Nope. Okay. Just a waste of money. <laughs> That's just fine with me. Alright, Mathayu, I am ready to begin military training. All troops will now head north to attack the Imperial forces. What? So suddenly? I thought this was just a drill. The Imperial army will think so too. We mustn't miss this opportunity. We'll attack the north immediately. A surprise attack. No wonder there was so much equipment for a drill. We'll now head north, Commander. Please confirm. Master Griffith, the Liberation Army. Huh? Yes, I know, I know. They're out training today. They're suddenly attacking us. Yes, I know, I... Uh... You mean to say that our spy was mistaken? My god, what shall I do? How far have the Liberation Army advanced? They're right in front of our eyes, sir! Right in front of our eyes! Hmm, this is a serious problem. Alright, you go report to General Kasim while I try to stall them. So, I'm guessing Sanchez is the spy. Because the way he was like, I thought this was just a drill. Like, why would he say that out loud? Plus, when you think about it, he's the only person who's always been around whenever the plans are being made. He's consistently been there. He was there when Odessa got murdered. Yeah, it has to be Sanchez. There's no way it could be anyone else. Because everyone else has been with us at some point in the story, except for Mathayu, but Mathayu was also not there when Odessa died. Yeah, it has to be, it has to be Sanchez. This is a ploy to stall us. We'd better attack at once. Give out the signal. Damn, we couldn't fool them. Troops, do the best you can. But don't waste your lives. Good night. I see you. So you want to see my magic? Aw, oh, man. Yippee! Congratulations! We won! I thought that if I joined the Imperial Army, I was all set for life. I was wrong. Yes, you were. Oh yeah, I enabled retro achievements <laughs> for the emulator. It's kind of cool. Hell, I guess we lost. All right, all right, we surrender. Lives are precious things. Join you. And betray the Imperial Army? Promise me one thing. Will you spare my troops? Of course. I guarantee their lives. Then I'll agree to your proposition. Whether I'm fighting for the Imperials or the Liberation Army, it makes no difference to me, as long as I can eat. You know what? I respect that. What wonderful men you are. Thank you, everybody. Commander, we will march north before the enemy finds out that we have taken the northern checkpoint. Sir Lepon, I'll give you a battalion to attack the fortress of Duha. Sir Humphrey, I'll assign another battalion to you. Take the fortress of Rakan. As protector of the north, Kasim will be forced to send reinforcements to their respective fortresses. Meanwhile, we'll sneak into Moravia Castle and rescue Warren and Victor. This mission will be carried out by yours truly. Commander, Kasumi, Kren, Griffith, and three others. 
Not mind being a decoy, but what if the reinforcements attack us? We'll have no chance of winning. The Imperial troops arrive. Retreat immediately. Then we won't have time to sneak into Moravia Castle. Don't worry, we too have asked for support. The Dragon Knights? No, but they're still a dependable force. Those are the details of our plan. Please take action immediately. Commander, please select the party that will break into Moravia. Well, well then. Guess we're taking Cleo. Uh, where's Luke? And. Do we want to? Wonder what the hate rune does. I kind of want to take Ronnie and see if she's any good. Let's try her out. Or we could take the flake, I guess. Yeah, we'll take flick. He's pretty strong. Just fix this formation. Or not. <laughs> what do you want with me? Griffith, you're going to help us sneak into Moravia. What do you mean? Griffith, I want you to pretend that you captured me. Commander will enter the castle with us, disguised as one of your men. I see. A ruse, huh? I don't mind, but do you really trust me? Think of the fate of your men should anything happen to me. It's true that I would make an excellent present for your former leader. But you're not a man who would betray your own men. You see right through me, don't you? All right. I'm in. Now that that's settled, let's hurry on to Moravia. No, let me get the chest, you bastard. All right. Uh, Cleo, why don't you get up front? She's not a terrible frontliner. She has pretty good defense. Old Book, Volume 7. Yippee. We didn't upgrade all the weapons of everyone else. I guess it really won't matter that much. Grab them some levels real quick by killing these dudes off. I guess that means the soul leader is sucking in their souls, huh? We're just taking a bunch of monster souls with us. Everywhere we go. Monsters wanna know. Dang, this is a big, big castle. Moravia. And now the Fortress of Rakan. The Liberation Army is making fools of us. I'll teach them a lesson. Really, dude? Like, ten people just saw you standing there behind them and you just, like, ran behind the, <laughs> the wall? Why, Sir Griffith, I'm glad you survived. We heard you were attacked. It was hell. But they shouldn't have underestimated me. Look at who I have here. This is Mathayu, military strategist of the Liberation Army. I took him prisoner. Let me in like to report to General Kasim. Yes, sir. I will inform immedi him immediately. Please wait a minute. Is this really going to work? If it doesn't, I'll escape by myself. Hee-hee! <laughs> Got a thing to say, Kren. You'd leave behind Master Weed? I don't know. Please enter and proceed to the waiting room. This seems like a trap. Commander Weed, while Griffin and I are in the waiting room, we must get Victor and Warren. The prison should be on the top floor of the castle. I'm not sure how long I can fool General Kasim. They capture us, we're dead. Let's hurry, Weed. Hey, we got the pink paint. Oh my. That's a lot of uh, enemies. Straight to hell with ya. Give me that sweet, sweet XP. Oh, he's fast. 
Okay. Well. Wait, did I bring Sylvina with us? I don't remember. I did not. Okay. Hopefully the Cyclone Rune has access to healing. If not, we might be in trouble. Dang, that's a nice hit. Oh, dang, he hits hard. That's sad, miss. Come on, Kasumi, you can do better. Tei Kyoku? I wonder what that is. Defense plus 48 and speed bonus. Let's give that to Kasumi, I guess. Maybe I should go back and get them some better gear and such. Actually, why don't we do this? Let me see the rune real quick. Wind of sleep, the shredding. Healing wind. Okay, he can still... He can still heal. Let's see what Judgment does. Oh, it's a single target. Interesting! Cleo... Just in case we need more. You can defend, you can defend. I'll just save our healing win for now. I'm gonna give you Shrike. What does that do? Oh, okay. Interesting. I guess that next level up gave us just enough to outspeed that uh little dude over there. A wolf tamer. Beast Master Wolfman. 9006. Oh wow. There's a lot of damage. Not quite level 53, but close. I guess we'll let you heal up real quick. Does healing wouldn't only work on one person? I'm gonna go upgrade people's weapons real quick and I'll come back. I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Sorry about that. I ended up getting a flick of water crystal just because I felt like we needed more AoE healing. Um, Alright, let's just kill all these dudes off real quick. Uh, and I went ahead and rested at the end too because I noticed I was missing a bunch of runes again for some reason. Or spell cast, rather. Well, I do not know why. I thought we rested in our room, but I guess not. Or maybe the rest only applies to people in your party? That could be what it was. I also went ahead and upgraded Kryn and Kasumi's weapons. Not that I think they'll be using them, but, you know. Why not? Are these rooms? There she goes. She's doing some good damage now. Good job, good job. Okay, they're not runes. Or rooms. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm so used to saying runes that any time the same syllables come out, it's just like, alright. You're gonna say runes now. Is a little bit confusing. It looks like the. It looks very, very similar. Just 
kind of funny. Mega medicine. Nom 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 nom. We can't cross this. I'll take care of it. There we go. Good job, Kryn. You're a loyal spy. A needle? A needle, do you? Cover's balloon. I don't think I've been ballooned once this entire game. I don't even know what it does. We did it. This must be it. You're late, Weed. I've been waiting forever for you to show up. Why don't you stay a little longer and cool off? What did you say? Who do you think you're talking to? Catch me if you can. Oh, you better run, Kryn. You must be Commander Weed. I am Warren. Thank you for coming for us. Didn't I tell you they'd come, Warren? You certainly did. We don't have much time. Let's hurry. Been a long time, hasn't it, Matthias Silverberg? Three, maybe four years. Why did you leave the Imperial Army? Because of that incident? That is one reason. But more because I dislike myself intensely when I am fighting. And yet you joined the Liberation Army. A strange man. Why don't you come back to us? I'd rather not execute you as a traitor. You needn't worry about that. What do you mean? General Kasim, we're surrounded by the Liberation Army! Ah, I see. Those attacks in the fortresses were a decoy. You're getting rusty, Mathayu. When the reinforcements return, the Liberation Army will be wiped out. If they return, that is. What's that? We've just received word that the troops sent out to protect the fortresses were ambushed by the Joustin Army. What's the Joustin Army? That is correct. I sent Joustin a letter informing them of the Imperial Army plans to invade their land. The city-state of Joustin is hungry for this empire. It's quite easy to manipulate them. Traitor? You dare sell out this land to the city-state? I have no such ambitions. I merely manipulated them. In no way have I joined hands with Joustin. It is likely that the city-state will temporarily occupy this region. But the Liberation Army will permit no more than that. Damn you to hell, you conniving turncoat. As to Mathayu, are you alright? You're pretty much taking care of business outside. Yo. Humphrey, you're so weird. Looks like we're just in time. General Kasim, now it is my turn to make a request. Please surrender. The ideal empire you once envisioned has changed beyond recognition. The Emperor himself, to whom you pledge loyalty, has changed too. Do you still plan to cling to the past? You are a stubborn man, Kasim, like the rest of the five great Imperial Generals. Think about it. Do you really think that the Emperor is the same man we once knew? You know he isn't. You are one of the Emperor's loyal followers. Isn't it your duty, then, to try to convince him to mend his wrongful ways? The five great generals were unable to prevent the Empire from deteriorating. Therefore, the time has come to help the Emperor open his eyes. Do you not agree? Alright, I surrender. Oh, did he not have a rune on him? If we wait around too long, the city-state will attack us. What? Nothing for me to do? Shucks. I was looking forward to a good rumble. Oh, well, that's lame. I guess I didn't need to do all that. What are these things? Rabbit birds. They're hideous. The time has finally come to deliver a crushing blow to those despotic Imperials. Must give the Liberation Army a hand. Don't be late, Sancho. Yes, master. Ready, charge! Who the hell are you? We're in a hurry. The Liberation Army eagerly awaits our help. We must hurry to Moravia Castle. Master? 
What is it, Sancho? This fellow... I said, what is it, Sancho? He's Master Weed, leader of the Liberation Army. What? My god. Please forgive my rudeness. My name is Maximilian, former commander of the late lamented Knights of Maximilian. As my final job, I'd like to lend a hand to the Liberation Army. Please, let me join you. I beg you. P -p Please grant my master his wish, sir. Please. Okay. Yippee! Oh my god, that's so loud. That was random. If I hadn't walked back through here, would they just not have joined? Makes me wonder how many other things I missed by fast traveling. Um, that being said, <laughs> time to fast travel. <laughs> Kind of annoying that I wasted all that money on people who I didn't really need to use it on. <laughs> but that's fine. Commander, at this time we've liberated most of the Empire, leaving only the Imperial Capital. The Liberation Army is becoming a comparable in force to the core of the Imperial Army, still remaining at the capital. Good. We're ready. What target do we attack next? The capital, no doubt. To get to the capital, we must get past the fortress of Quaba. Commanded by Ein Guide? Ein Guide? Or over the water, past General Sonia, Shulin's floating fortress of Shazarzaid. <laughs> what a mouthful! I say via the fortress of Quaba. We can't prepare enough boats. That is exactly what the enemy will think. Don't worry about the boats. I will have 500 of them prepared by tomorrow. 500 boats? Alright, let's get to work. Thank you, sir. I swear I will keep my promise. Please look forward to tomorrow. It's gonna be a big fight tomorrow. Better retire early tonight. Bro, I'm pretty sure he's leaking this bullshit about boats to... to Sanchez to throw him off this, the trail. Why else would he say that? I bet we're not actually attacking... Chazar... <laughs> however you say it. Yes, Sir Humphrey. I heard that you were once in the Imperial Army, and that the Kelica incident was the reason you left. That is true. I was unable to prevent that tragedy. In the middle of the war, I discovered my own powerlessness and then left the Imperial forces. I was hoping to lead a quiet life, never to see war again. I was one of the soldiers who attacked Kalika. I've never been able to forget that incident. In my fury, I attacked my own commander and became a fugitive. That was the first time I attacked someone out of pure hatred, and I hope that it was the last time. Humphrey, this is no time to be distressed. We have a job to do. Once the war is over, then you can be sad. Damn, Matthew. <laughs> you really said, fuck your feelings. Hey, half-dead. We've got a big battle tomorrow. What are you doing? What are you doing yourself, novice? I told you not to enter my room without permission. Geezer. You might drop dead tomorrow, so I came to see your face. Thanks to Master Matthias' crazy scheme, I've got to work all night. I just took a little break to come and see you. Oh, -ho! now shall brew my finest tea. You mean coffee, right? It will be a huge battle tomorrow. Please protect me. Aw, poor Cleo. What's the matter, Taiho? You're not drinking. Huh? No. I was just thinking about tomorrow. That's not like you at all. Let's have a good time tonight, just the two of us, until sunrise. Damn, girl! Calm down. It's true, big brother. There's three of us. <laughs> big brother has a weakness for the ladies. Better stay here and protect him. <laughs> wow, the cock block is real. I 
Isn't the moon beautiful tonight, Hits? Huh? Did you say something, Tengar? Have some of this fish. It's delicious. Man, it's clueless, bro. Tengar's has her handfuls. What are you doing out here, Sir Flick? You'll catch a cold. Oh, nothing. Just thinking. About... Lady Odessa? We have an early morning tomorrow. Better get back to bed. If you can't sleep, I have some good tea. Thanks, Sanchez. Huh. Interesting. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe he's actually... Nice. No, 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 no chance, dude. Sanchez has to be this guy. It, it literally couldn't be anyone else. What do you think? Can we win tomorrow? We can. We can, but... Many young lives will be lost. The thought pains me. Me too. The old ones are prepared, but it hurts to see young ones die. Coming in. Were you asleep? Amazing how you can sleep before a big battle. Just like a true leader. I have something to give you. Take it. Pain the steel hatchet. This was Grimia's hatchet. I brought it back from Sonia prison. They kept it hidden away until now. I thought it would only sadden you more. But I may lose my life tomorrow, so I thought I'd give it to you tonight. Weed, it will be a big battle tomorrow. Many lives will be lost. But you must go on. For all the soldiers who believe in a better future. For Grimio. Right? Going back to my room now. It's wind tomorrow. That was weird. And we need to rest again after we get our party together. I'm not even going to bother putting the party together this time, because I'm pretty sure it's going to, as usual, throw some people in with me. Take a look at this boss. The medical officer sure has some crazy ideas. No kidding. Using my thrash for something like this. Commander, please take a look at this. It's made out of ice. It throws it by using a dragon's breath. Incredible. It's floating all right, and pretty sturdy too. As promised, we prepared 500 boats. And now await your orders, Commander. Do it. I swear by my name of Sonia Shul oh, the Sonia Shulin that I will be defend the floating fortress. Wish it would scroll a little faster. magic as usual. Let's pray that we get lucky. What? Why did... Why didn't I get to use magic too? Try that again.
Oh no. Oh no! <laughs> I chose wrong! Dragon Knights? Ooh, let's try that. Make the enemy turn traitor. Let's try that. The big success. Yippee! Wow. Leave it to me, sir. The enemy's next plan is Sonya's magic. I guess we're using those. Guess that's Juju. Probably. Ninja's OP. I'm so sorry, Master Tio. Lost to your son. How could I? Alright, let's save. All right. Unload the oil barrels. Commander, we will burn the fortress down with oil. To do so, you must go and close the floodgate at the far end of the fortress. As soon as it's closed, we'll pour the oil and set the fortress on fire. At the far end of the fortress? Yes. Kasumi has already scouted the area. Please choose your men. Yay, we get Victor back. We lose Flick and Humphrey. Okay. It's fine. Take Cleo. Um, where is she? Sylvina. My water rune. Um, Luke, you can join the party. Or Luck, whatever your name is. <laughs> And then Valeria. Where is Valeria? Third page, maybe? Yeah, there you are. Alright, let's change our formation. You can be on the back. Actually, here, get up front. Chaos Shield. Actually weaker than the Earth Shield. That's interesting. Bunch of knights. Defend, defend. Go straight to hell, my friends. Actually, why don't you heal a little bit? I want to see. It really only does work on one person. Which in that case. I guess we're faster than Sylvina. Goodbye, warriors. Dang, these guys are worth a lot of money.
the heck are these? Sirens? Alright, let's defend, defend, defend. Defend, defend, and then click. No, no, no. You do some dancing flame for us. Hopefully, they're not resistant to fire. I didn't think about that. Yeah, they are, actually. Uh oh. Uh oh. <laughs> oh no, we're silenced! Um, I'm gonna see his free will. It's probably fine. Actually, just use up this crap real quick. A little bit more room. Guard ring. Is that any good? Oh, it's actually good for you. Boots. Uh, I think I prefer to have the wing boots on. Well, let's give that to someone else. You have wing boots, cape of darkness. You have silverlet and boots. Oh, we can give it to Victor. Just wearing some shitty boots. There you go, sir. All good to go now. Master garb. Okay. Fifty-five and skill bonus. Dang, son. Um. Well, I don't want to freak around with your inventory, so put that on. <laughs> Let me get rid of this. Dragon armor. No one can even wear that, so. Adios, dragon armor. She hits hard as crap. Such a good, good. Oh, I got sound setting three from that. <laughs> what? <laughs> Mobs can drop sound settings. It's kind of funny. All right, weed. Do your nastiness. See you in hell, sirens. Hey, level 54, too. Let's go down. There you are. What the heck is this? Shell Venus? Why did Victor say there you are? See what judgment does. And then it may need to be healed. Nah. Let's see what the cyclone rune can do. Shining wind. And you can use explosion. Let's see what judgment does. Uh-oh. Holy crap! 1579! Judgment's a little OP. Oh wow, it heals and attacks. That's pretty good. Ouch. Ouchers. That hit just a little bit. Oh, we have another judgment. Let's do it. Let's heal up. And you can... I'll use Storm this time. Then... 
I didn't seem like it did much, probably because it's fire. We'll just have Cleo attack. Honk. Nice. Noise? Oh, actually, I did more than, uh, or that did less than Cleo's uh, explosion magic. So maybe, maybe Judgment's just OP as heck. Falcon Rain. Um, do we even want to use Black Shadow? Or just attack? Let's just attack. Lena. We are out of healing, so now it is Shining Wind's turn to shine. Nice. Nice. It's funny that a boss is like a giant clamshell with some weird avatar inside of it. Sure is strong though. Or tanky at least. Oops. Nice. 420, very good. What we like to see. <laughs> Nice one, Victor. 705 damage. 15. Oh, he didn't do an AoE this time. Strange. In that case, we'll hold off on our Shining Wind. I don't know how many turns this thing has left in it. All I know is it has a lot of HP. We're easily doing like 1500 a turn. Right, now we need to heal. thousand bits. I'll go close the floodgates. You wait here. Yippee! Good job, Victor. You're a strong man. This should do. Now all I have to do is escape and burn this place down. Thunder crystal. And I think there's one more item on the left. Goodbye, sirens. Ah, my brain. I'm going to see if I can figure out how to disable that sound before the next video. Or at least turn it down, because that's really loud. In fact, let me check right now. I don't want to hear that anymore. Okay, so in the emulator, there's an option to just disable the sound for the achievements. Not a way to turn it down, unfortunately, but at least you can turn it off. Kerberos. Ouch. You missed. You missed. Oh, not dead. Interesting little beast. I don't know why a fire dog spirit is at a fortress filled with water floating in the middle of the ocean, but 
you know, sometimes it's best just not to question things. Wait a minute. I must ask you something. Hey, you're that Imperial leader. Yes, I am the last of the five great Imperial generals. I want to ask you, why did you betray the Empire? Why did you betray your own father, Tio? Inciting rebellion? Causing war? Taking lies? Is this what you call justice? What you're saying is not true. What? Why is the oil already lit? It's too early. The all-consuming flame. Is this your answer? Is this what you want? You raised your sword against Tio. You will pay. Now, with your life! Aw, oh, snap. Um, well, <laughs> hopefully she doesn't have too many AoEs, because I didn't bring any extra um, healing stuff. Um, Alright, let's do our best. Dancing flames. So much damage we can do a turn to her. She has some really nice physical defense, so I'll give her that. Should I have an attack? And then, why don't you heal old area? Because she did take a pretty hefty amount of uh, damage there. Victor, bro. Victor getting slapped. <laughs> you heal him again, please. Oh, don't heal weed. Heal Victor. Chunk here, chunk here. Doesn't do much damage to Valeria though. This Valeria is kind of tanky though. but it hurt. Fortunately, we're starting to get a little low on healing AoEs, so this last shiny win actually is our last healing AoE. Let's try Dancing Flames on her real quick. Valeria. <laughs> How could you? How could you do that? Uh, of course, she loses on the turn that Valeria's down. <laughs> That's not right. We got 1,500 bits out of that. As I thought, I cannot defeat you. After all, you beat Tio. I mean, he was at half health, but yeah. But I will not let you defile me. I am the Empire's, His Highness's, 
Tios. Stop it. What are you doing? Can't let a pretty lady like you die. Besides, you seem to have your reasons. Weed will take this general with us. Okay. Also, who tried to kill us while we were in here? Master Mathayu! What happened? Are you alright? Sanchez! Damn you! I knew it, bro. What have you done? Why did you light the oil before receiving orders? Answer me, Sanchez. I'm sorry, Master Flick. I've been deceiving you all this time. I've been in the employ of the Emperor since the War of Succession, seven years ago. And you're the spy? That is right. In the days of the War of Succession, His Majesty was a wonderful man. And like everyone else, I swore allegiance to him. When the hideout was attacked in Odessa. Are you to blame for Odessa's death? That was the result. I won't deny it. My heart was in pain. Being with you people, I began to question myself. Who's right? What should I do? Ultimately, I chose to remain loyal to the Emperor. At my age, it's difficult to change one ways li one's way of life. I'm sorry about Lady Odessa. Bro, you need to die right now. Kill him, Flick. Do it. I will not forgive you. In the name of my sword, Odessa, I will take your head. Yes. I have no regrets. But please remember one thing. I like you. All of you. You know what? Fuck you. <laughs> No, Mathayu, let him die! You kill Ch Sanchez now, and the troops find out that he was a spy, the morale of the Liberation Army will plummet. Administer the punishment later. Right now, we must prepare the army and march to Greg Minister. There's a thing called flow in this world. There's a thing called timing in warfare. If we lose this opportunity, we will never defeat the Empire. Commander, you must decide. What? Come on, Flick. Just do it real quick. No! <laughs> Alright, let's go heal everyone real quick. The inn is on... Second floor? Where's the first floor? Oh god. It's probably the first floor, isn't it? Okay, it was. Good. Yay! <laughs> Let's save, too. In fact, this is probably a great place to wrap this uh, video up, so I will see you in the next one. Thank you so much for watching, and I hope you have a great day.